Hello. Hello, my friend. You asked me what you can learn from your past. How you can turn your past into something good for the present. And what's the point in thinking about the past? Well, that's quite simple. Your brain uses your past experiences to create new connections. If you're not willing to use those connections, you're just wasting them. And the way to put things into memory and to actually make those connections rather than just to have experiences that you don't use in the present or for the future is to take time to reflect on the past. Now, of course, there's an art to that. Most of us are reactive about the past. We don't like the things that have happened to us and we keep perseverating about them, which means we keep thinking about them, reiterating, going over them again and again and again feeling bad about it. And the point is to go beyond that, to learn to face what's gone wrong. And there's always lots that goes wrong in the past, of course. Lots goes wrong in our life, every day of our lives. So we need to make ourselves flexible and elastic so that we can face those things and not be afraid of them. So that we can Think about them, reflect on them, pass them back through our minds again and again and again, sieving out of them the things that matter, the things that are of importance, the things we can learn from it. And as we learn, we improve as we understand why things went wrong and what we did right what we liked and what we didn't like and what we can do to get on better with other people or what we can do to have more respect for ourselves or what we can do to take actions instead of regretting things to be true to ourselves, to be true to our values, to do right rather than wrong to do something rather than nothing the more we learn about what we did wrong in the past and the more we learn what it is we want to do in the future. So the past is an immense resource for us every day of our lives. Learning from the past is one of the many ways in which we learn to live a better life. And I hope you stop being afraid of your past or curse it or condemn it or feel sorry for yourself or feel bad about your life and start using it for the fertile ground it is full of opportunities full of possibilities unexploited opportunities for learning so much more to retrieve from every moment of your past I go over my past all the time it changes with every new experience, it shines a new light on something that I did before. And so it all connects together and it all starts to work together. It all falls into place like a great big puzzle. The past becomes a picture that I improve all the time, that makes more and more sense, in which I find more and more meaning. You have to toughen yourself up to face the unpleasantness of the past and to dare believe that there's nothing wrong with getting things wrong and that there's everything right with learning from what went wrong and that it's always possible to set your past more right and to make much more of it for the present and of course ultimately for a great future in which you take charge of your life 
your own past events and you learn to be responsible in the moment so that you can make that wonderful connection plaiting, braiding the past, present and future together so that it all holds strong and it is your life you own it you make the most of it you enjoy it warts and all no matter what that's the past for you you got plenty of it and the older you get the more you've got and that makes it better all the time so enjoy your life don't discard your past value it take care my friend <laughs>